for once, I have actually printed something really, really good. Hey guys, it's TammyT2009, and I'm here with a slightly newer video. Now this is another Thomas the Tank Engine video, and this is going to be quite an interesting and really good video for me, because look at all these wonderful three printed trains I've made here. Every single one of them is flawless. These trains, when I tell you, are some of the best ones I've ever printed. This has to be like some of my favorite things I've ever printed. Aside from my three printed My Little Pony characters there. If you guys would like me to review those, tell me in the comments. Anyways. So, we have all these characters here with actual three faces. Really well painted trains here. And we're going to give them magnets pretty soon. But this isn't all the characters here. We have a few more characters to cover. Anyways, who am I reviewing today? Well, let's review the train that I completed the first. Duck, the Great Western Engine. Now, Duck isn't too bad of a start. Like, Duck is a fan favorite character. Like, personally, I think Duck is one of my favorite characters as well. But just look at that face. I am in love with that face. Like, it's really... It's a three face. It's no longer printed for um, some people who really wanted me to give them three faces. I know there are a couple who might have, but I just succeeded to deliver because these faces look really, really beautiful. Like, I'm really surprised at how well these came out. Like, I'm really good at painting faces. Like, I did not think that I would be this advanced. Excuse me. Anyways. We have all Duck's detail here, the GWR and the number 8. And personally, Duck's design just looks so accurate to the TV show. I would say the thing that's inaccurate would be the fact that he has no side rods. But all the engines don't have side rods. Now, if you're wondering why that is, I was wanting these engines to be kind of simplistic. Not as simplistic as Wooden Railway, but just a little simplistic. Like, a few things. But he does have the white running board. He has the black buffers and the black sides, which is something that we don't get on Thomas merchandise. So this is a really nice touch here. Duck just came out so beautifully here. This was really fun to paint, and I'm super happy with a duck. The thing that I like most is the magnets here. I was inspired by the Earl Gold Rail Thomas trains to do this, so that's kind of a nice touch here. So, I do plan to couple up these engines soon, and give them rolling stock as well. I don't know if I could say much more about Duck here, but he really is a beautiful model here. Like, Duck almost looks like how he looks in the TV show. I'm not sure if the face is 100% accurate, but it's the least I can do for Duck. Personally, I think all these other faces came out really well. Like, I personally love Diesel 10's evil face. Like... Look how amazing that is. That just put a smile on my face. Alright guys, so... Thanks for watching this video. What do you guys think of Duck here? Do you think I did a good job? Now, I must say that I do plan to print more of these trains one day and sell them on eBay. For you guys to have and paint. So, if you guys would like me to sell these trains on eBay, then I'm going to print like more copies of them. Just blank and unpainted for you to have. If you want to buy them, just go to eBay. And stay tuned for these other characters. Which characters are you looking forward to seeing the most? And which characters do you want me to print next? I am thinking of printing James next in a few minutes. And I do hope that you'll stay tuned for these three printed guys here. Because these look amazing as well. They're completely flawless and reminiscent to the TV show. Anyways, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more. Bye!